Twitter. Hello. How's it going? Great. Yeah. I saw you out right outside, so I thought I'd come say hi. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Cheers. Awesome. Yeah, they, they've got their I love your art. Oh, yeah, art. <laughs> yeah. Just trying to do, uh, do you know, contrast easier on the eye. Something love like it. That. Whatever. Yeah. You should have seen the uh, the uh, Canadian um, uh, tourist's uh, drunken art over there that I erased. It was, there was a plane and it was being blown up by a rocket. And Where uh, is this? It, well, I erased it. Oh, that's what that <laughs> was. It, it was, uh, I think uh, it was uh, blurring the, the message. Right? It, it was like a, a Tom Cruise action scene with his like penis out and everything. It was crazy. He's taking a poop. What can I even add? Chat, what anything, should I add? Any, anything you like. <laughs> you know, um, I, have enough, I have to work early in the morning, but I have enough time to come out and, and add a little bit to the art. Sure, sure. If you like. Yeah, yeah. So, um,. I Thanks, mean, Alex. yeah, any of the other messages are it's something else, I guess. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, like, uh, as soon as secta oh. is not present. That's a good one. Let's see, what color am I going to get? Perhaps something about child trafficking. Say, cult Yeah. Set up a piece of cord right. at the center point, 
Measure out 10 feet, exactly. and that's 10 foot radius. I just radius. Need, a, I need a helper. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> I need a helper. I was gonna do it during the day when they're not gonna really be, like, you know, right there, but uh, I think the, at night is the only time the tent is up. So yeah, and they, might, have, have they might power wash it. This? I mean, the, no, oh, yeah, I'm yeah, trying yeah. to lock them down. Yeah, like, yeah. if they you do it during will. the day, as soon as you step away, they're going to power watch you. Right, right. I mean, I went to move my, I went around the block to move my car at Big Blue and they power washed my job. Now, see, I'm not as beautiful of an artist as selfless self over there. No, it's in there. <laughs> it's in there. Got the who's the the squiggly line artist, the one who uh, does the uh, animation for the critic. Oh, of and course. Well, <laughs> you remember the critic? Yes, yes, I do, <laughs> absolutely. And that that's uh, John Lovitz. John Lovitz. Yeah, that's John Lovitz. Oh, sorry. No, no worries. No, 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 the box I was blocking in half. I didn't mean to block your path. No, no, go, go thank for it. Thank you. Yo, good. It's his work, his hard work. I can say thank you, but it ain't nothing. It wasn't me. It's gonna blow away with the wind, so don't worry. Don't worry. This, this is impermanent, like all things. No, 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 that's cool. Oh, I, I like I'm glad it. you like it. I love it. Yeah, because it's obvious these guys suck. What am I writing? Yeah, oh, uh, uh, es so una secta. Yeah, <laughs> this is what I wrote. Yeah. So that's indicating maybe a direction too. So. Just, in, just in case anybody was curious, which direction the. That's right. Sometimes you have to be really, really. Which clear. direction not to go? Correct. And then safety orange, no less. That's all the stuff that I erased. Yeah, so very drunk help from Canada. People are gonna think that the help that I gave was drunk help. Oh no, 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 no. It's alright, I don't mind, I don't mind. No, 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 yes, no. No, no, no. I'm gonna see what you guys are saying. Are you saying anything? I know, right? That's fun to make art though. Everyone tonight will see it. Yeah, you know, and it kind of makes a point that grabs people's interest. If, you know, you look like you're maybe doing something and people might ask a question. I'm looking for the conversation that's sparked Sandy, by, thank you. by this silliness. Oh, Danny, you're in here? Oh, nice. You got Danny? I guess so. Hi. Danny. Danny boy. He hasn't seen The Shining and his name's Danny. Oh my gosh, we need to do a movie Danny night. Boy! couple movie night things we got to do well oh, so quick. 
Did I miss something? Oh, uh, not really. Playing hopscotch? Yeah. Danny's impact. scotch. Yeah, this is, I can't even compare. This is like a, you, you need to decorate my next party. Okay. Oh, everything's shut down. It's Monday night. It's pretty quiet. I thought it would be a good chance to actually get out here and not block a bunch of pedestrians and chalk the heck out of the information. Do you want to see over the fence? Second. Okay. Would help if I changed the view. <laughs> see your house <laughs> empty empty like their hearts sorry about that good the good witch want to go to the side I'm gonna look at the side. Why not? Yeah, no, you can see right through their nylon sheer tech in there. There's a bunch of signs up. Nylon sheer tech. Thanks, Robert James. Thanks for pointing it out. I wonder if one of them is assigned to me specifically. I don't even know how many people. It's because I'm double streaming. I don't, it's hard for me to tell. Oh, 141. see anyone every time I look in these windows I see a reflection from what's behind me like this late I'm like oh they have new artwork in there <laughs> no it's right there <laughs> it seems backwards all right I'll change it it's otherwise it's backwards to me though Hold on, let me fix it it's either backwards to you or backwards to me uh, how can I fix this camera pro uh, change it backwards? No. Camera? Nope. Nope. It's not letting me turn it backwards. I don't know how to do it. It's good now? All right. Sure. Yeah, Scientologists can hit the like button. Hey, Aussie, Wendy. Nice to see you. I'm not alone out here, so I'm okay. Welcome. Please use entrance on Hollywood Boulevard. The selfie class cam is flipped. So when it's facing me, it's backwards. All right, good to know. I'm trying to... You can't... Can I get the fancy sword next to my name? <laughs> How do you do that? You see, I, I'm like, oh, look at that artwork inside of that butterfly. Can you guys see the butterfly? Oh, that's actually it. <laughs> Can I tell you how many times I've fallen for that exact thing? Thanks, wildflower. Oh, yeah, heck yeah. How do I do this, Danny? Uh, add as a moderator. Heck yeah. Yeah, impact has been added as a moderator. Yeah, of course you can. Trust you with my life. <laughs> In this world, since I've started protesting, trust has been the most 
valuable commodity. It costs nothing, but it's invaluable. Oh no, I'm out here by myself. I'm an opera singer, I'll just sing loud and break all the windows if there's any problem that somebody comes up. Some crazy character, I'll just wake everyone up in the neighboring, neighboring businesses and buildings. Coward's entrance and back. Not what I heard. Not what I heard. Squirrel Squad Cam, oh, let me mod you too. Oops. Ha! Now you have to be a mod! <laughs> Who will I mod next? Just kidding. <laughs> Where's Leah? I don't see her. It, wait, is this, is this you, Leah? Is this Leah Leah on, on YouTube? Yeah, wait, yes? Danny, are you on YouTube and on Twitch at the same time? All right, you're a moderator, Leah. You're a moderator, and you're a moderator. I really was going to bed, and then I saw selfless self out here. This is just too close for me not to come out and say hi. But what am I doing? I'm around the side of the building. You take blue status as well. All right. Make sure I did it all right. Now look at him. Oh, doing the good work. At the same time saying you're broken and Scientology Hello. can only fix you. And then, so you'll keep taking courses, trying to go up the bridge to clear. Now, reaching the state of clear can cost you up to like $100,000, right? $100,000 and quite a lot of bit of your time. Great. Now, maybe you can get back the money. Ain't no getting back your time, right? And so then they'll have you go up the OT levels, right? And there's OT one through eight. Getting all the way to OT eight might cost you about half a million dollars, sometimes more. Sometimes they make you take these classes a few times at a time. A few times since if, if you don't do it right, maybe right. you don't complete it and then they'll have you take it again, right? And so some people will end up paying maybe nearly a million dollars to go OT eight and it's worth Right? So, like they're not teaching you anything. What happens at OT level three is that they reveal to you the secret of Scientology at that point. And unfortunately for them, this was released for free on the internet in 2004 and possibly before. Sorry. So are you guys coming from like the standpoint of like, you guys are like Christians trying to like, like show oh, that this no. is a cult? Or are you just no. kind of like just saying like, No, no, no. Okay. There's, there, it, I mean, it's people of all faiths, people of all walks of life. It's just because of the destruction that this cult does. Now, some people are born into this, right? You're born into it, your parents brought you into it, you're born into it, and so at the, the upper level of Scientology, say like the monastic order of Scientology is called the Sea Org, the Sea Organization. And if you're born in, you can be brought into the Sea Organization in your teenage years. Now, you're made to sign a billion-year contract it's not billion, an exaggeration. A billion year contract. And the idea is that you're meant to come back and serve Scientology for multiple, multiple lifetimes. And their motto is, we come back, right? And so they sign people up for the Sea Org in their teenage years, like 15, 16, 17, signing a billion year contract for God knows what it's going to be, right? Those people don't get to see the outside world. They don't have access to the internet. They're not allowed to do their own shopping. They're not allowed to contact their family members. Family members of Sea Org members sometimes don't see them for years at a time. You're lucky if you see them once or twice a year. Their kids are kept separate from it. So like, um, obviously to you guys, this is like a cult, but like, do you guys think that other religions are cults? Yes. Okay, like all or just no. like, okay. I mean, some of them are more or less helpful. If you're right. doing family disconnection like these people do, so like if you become an enemy of the church, if you want to leave the church, one of the ways they try to threaten you to keep you in is that you'll be disconnected from your family. The rest of your family that's in can never speak to you again while you are outside of the church. Right. And you'll be labeled a suppressive person is what they call it, which is their word for an enemy of the church. And at that point, any suppressive person identified by the church the, the dictates of, of this cult say that 
They can break any law, they can break any moral code, they can come after you in any way, and they ruin people's lives, they dox them, they go after their employment, they go after their friends, and they will never leave you alone. They're vicious, they've committed multiple crimes, allegedly killed some pets, they've done a bunch of nasty, nasty, nasty things. And they're under investigation by the feds right now, and hopefully a whole lot more. So we're trying to just push it along, and raise consciousness about what's going on with this set, uh, with this cult, as soon as that goes. But uh, this is a flyer. This is a new foundation that uh, was founded around uh, the community of channels, uh, of which we are a part, but mainly SPTV is like uh, a group of channels that survivors of Scientology. Uh, is this also like on your, like, like is this support, like, Oh, oh, no, no. The, the, so the SPTV Foundation, this would be a number to call if you are trying to get out of this cult. Right? Oh. And then, so this just will give you some information on the back. It's, so Scientology is accused of these crimes. Right. Signs that it's a cult. Yeah. Right. And if you look up Scientology on your own, there are plenty of documentaries that are critical of, of, of this pseudo-religion. Um, and uh, sorry, my gimbal's freaking out. I'm gonna turn it off. Okay, but uh, oh, like the um, YouTube channel? my YouTube channel? Yeah, for like the live stream. Oh, stuff. I'm at Selfless Self. Selfless Self. Correct. Okay. So uh, you should be able to see yourself on this live stream as soon as I upload it. <laughs> or if you turn on to my channel, maybe you could see me seeing you seeing. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Inception. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. How many? How many layers? Well, I don't know. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. That's uh, I respect what you do. I respect what all of you do. Yeah, I really respect. Yeah, what you, you watch know, I came hours from Massachusetts. Of stream from someone that was streaming on TikTok here. Oh, right. I'd watch hours of a stream daily and listen to what he's saying. Oh yeah, and that was when they were still open. I looked closed at the moment. Yeah, Is yeah, that... absolutely. That, well, there were a bunch of protesters. They basically shut up shop. I love that. Uh, the LA crew shut this shit down, and here they are all hidden away because they can't really confront people with uh, ideas that are critical of the church. Yeah. Uh, they don't even try anymore. They used to, and they had a lot more numbers, and they felt a lot more confident. At some point, the leader of the church, David Miscavige, kind of put the kibosh on that and said, we're not gonna deal with any of the protesters, we're not gonna deal with the press, we're gonna go totally insular, and we're gonna have no contact. So, other than negative contact when they're trying to mess with us, they're trying to have us arrested. <laughs> Try that a whole lot. Oh yeah, no, it's gotten dangerous in LA. Uh, some of, some of these protesters have been uh, spotted. Really? Yeah, they've been calling the police, uh, saying that you know there there are weapons around. There are never weapons around, right? And the police, you know, lay the protester down on the street with guns trained on them. Right. And choppers. Uh, I have not yet been swatted, but one of us, uh, DOA Defender of Ants, has been swatted three times in a month. Yep. Well, three I've, times. I have a question, real quick. Yes. Well, why this one and not like another Scientology building? Oh, I've been. <laughs> I, 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 was, I was at the other ones all day. Yeah. Okay. So okay, it, it's, it's not all just of this piece one. At a time. Yeah, I mean, if there were enough protesters, we would station ones at each freaking oh. building and like at the various corners so we might be able to watch all of their comings and goings. But this one is particularly important because it preys off of unsuspecting tourists just uh, walking down the street. Yeah. Like Correct. people who are just like looking to have a good time in Hollywood experience the town, like right in town, get uh, sucked in, lured in under false yeah. pretense. Um, yeah before they know it, it's too late, you know? And maybe yeah. they don't really know anything about what Scientology is at all. It's just like, oh, this person's well-groomed um, and, and they seem friendly. Uh, oh, what, a free movie? Because they'll show you some really ridiculous movie that, that is completely meaningless at, at, at some point. And that's usually the first thing that they do at a number of orgs to, to kind of bring you in and show you what Scientology is all about. And then they'll try to sell you a book. Have you done any one that's outside of California? Like yes. Like yeah, so um, I've come from Massachusetts. Yeah. And the first city I hit was Chicago. They opened one of these buildings in Chicago, and I was there for the opening. The dear leader, David Miscavige, was there. We did our best to try to ruin that for them and to alert uh, everybody in, um, in the neighborhood that uh, you have a dangerous cult in your backyard. Now, this building that they had put in Chicago right next door was a Columbia University dorm. 
and they had already infiltrated the dorm and they had tried to get access to the freaking college students, right? And they were going around to all no, the not really. they paid off they took twenty thousand dollars to one restaurant and ten thousand dollars to two others to basically be on their side during this event. Use one of the restaurants as their watering hole. And that's generally what they do. See, they've got billions of dollars in assets. They've been parking their money in real estate because they're a nonprofit uh, religious organization. And as such, you need to pre prove to the federal government that the donations that you're taking in, a certain percentage of those are going to either religious services or charitable works. And they don't have very much of either. So they need to hide their money from the government in buildings. Oh, thanks, so Marlene. That's what, so they open this building in Chicago. It's like a $200 million building, right? And it's probably under 10% occupied. They're just parking $200 million, basically. And, and they're still trying to keep the cult going, but their numbers are rocketing to the bottom. And so recently, uh, starting about 10 years ago, they've linked arms with the Nation of Islam. I don't know if you know the nation. See, it's not Islam, right? right? It's an American, like, ethno-nationalist, separatist sect of Islam that is not recognized by, by Islam proper in any way, shape, or form. They don't... They're, one of their main tenets is they don't believe in race mixing. So like, you know, which, which is really like disgusting and racist. Yeah. So it's like, it's like black supremacy yeah. in, in a way. And um, I find it particularly disgusting and, uh, my, myself. So they, they've linked arms with them for some reason because both of these organizations numbers are going into the toilet. And they're just, they're, they're trying to boot, they're trying their last dis, ditch efforts to like come together as like an amoeba of sex. Um, so the, the state Islam, that's like from the state of like, the US? Like no, 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 the, no, no, the nation, they just call themselves that, oh, right? Okay. So uh, like there are a lot of nationalist movements of the early 20th century and the nation of Islam is one, right? Mm -hmm. Like a lot of ultra national, like all the fascist uh, regimes in Europe, like include like the Spanish, the Portuguese fascist, the Croatian fascist, uh, the German, obvious, you know, fascist. Um, so nationalism was like a big thing, and the Nation of Islam is is like kind of the Black American Islamic pseudo Islamic um, uh, nationalism and eth ethno nationalist separatists. That kind of yeah. makes sense because isn't like on Islam, right? Are, uh, aren't you allowed to like marry your third cousin? I'm not sure about that. I'm not sure about that. I would that. see where they would get that idea from because that does sound very familiar. I'm not sure much. about that. But um, no, I mean, they, they don't want, you know, uh, pe pe like Af Af people of African descent of course, to marry yeah. into any other. They want to keep black people black as right. much as possible. And they seek out and try to like kind of punish or um, uh, ridicule people that engage in this. And it seems to me that intermarrying between ethnicities is like a really good idea to, on a genetic level, just for like health. She loves the and, art. Uh, for uh, us all getting to know each other a little bit better and becoming a, a global family. And uh, they're part of like an old guard of a number of other separatist movements that are trying to stop that process. Yeah. Which I, th I find revolting. And, and like a relic of another century that needs to die if we are going to survive this century. Would you like a flower? <laughs> You're so good. You guys lucked out today. <laughs> Run into this guy. Thank you so much. Thank you. Wicked. You guys always have like a, that many views? Like, um, uh, like I five? mean, I, th yeah, this is, uh, this is kind of... Today's been my peak. I, I've got 240. You've probably... I mean, you know, yeah. I'm getting there. Yeah. Yeah, some Hi. people get like a thousand people watching or along, watching along, yeah. but uh, I've been doing this for a month. I've been on the road for a uh, month. Okay. So, you, like, I've seen these videos before. Would that have been like a different guy doing this? Oh, tons of different uh, people. Oh, okay. Absolutely. Yeah. You know, out here, I think mainly you had uh, like Chris without a Hellcat was out here a lot. Yeah. He did a lot of setups. That oatmeal cookie setup that he did out here it was awesome. Um, Coffin and Chris. Uh, Cam yeah. Streets, Cam, Jessica, Streets, Streets LA, absolutely. Solomon, yeah, yeah, Aja, Aja, absolutely, yeah, Wow, DOA, Laura FM, two degree. I haven't seen her up here so much, but uh, so they've all stopped because of this place closing, 
Oh, I mean, you know, they, they showed up and, uh, and uh, uh, protested out here. They used to have people kind of like up and down yeah. the boulevard, uh, handing out flyers, trying to get people in here. Yeah. That's all shut down right now. I mean, we found kind of randos uh, like way out or, you know, trying to do it and then scared them back like within weeks. And I, I think they've given up to a degree. Am I? Does it seem like they've given up? I think they've given Yeah, at this one. Well, they, there was that leaked email saying that they plan to do something, but... Yay! Let's see what that, <laughs> that is. I mean, they always fall I see the, the security guy that, that's out here sometimes will lead people in. And then also I'm hearing that they'll, they've will they set up a table kind of off, right, you right, know, and right. then they'll yeah, send yeah, yeah, people yeah. in because they don't, they don't want to open the door. But they used to have like a... Uh, uh, like a Speaking triangle here. Will appear. <laughs> what? Where? Where's my goodie bag, Laura? Is Laura in your chat? Yeah. Hey. Hey, Laura. <laughs> Where's my goodie bag? <laughs> That's right. When was the last time you saw people out here still handing off flies in there? Um, like out, right outside, right out there. I was White here when that. Here? I was here, but I don't remember when that was exactly. Like two or three weeks ago. No, longer, longer, than longer than that. Longer than that, because it went went over to Blue La Poubelle and uh, Celebrity Center last like month or more, I'd say. But all the days are running into each other. Like since right. I was out here last, it's I don't even remember what day it was. Do you know of anyone that's been out here with you guys that has left this place? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. There are a bunch of survivors. Um, that uh, the SPTV community, the Laura, board, who was just in his yeah, chat, exactly. was born right up the street in the, one of the buildings. In, into it. I've, and I've just recently met a gentleman who's uh, come forward to tell a story for the first time, um, who lost his whole family to this, who was in since 1978 at 10, 10 years Bumblebee, old. Bumblebee, what do you want me to say um, to him? And uh, he just, he saw the protest outside Hi, of Big Blue and showed up to like uh, start talking to any of his protesters, very appreciative. He started his, his own YouTube channel, I think, yesterday. And he already has 400, 400 subs, and we hope to get him a whole heck of a lot more. What was his name? Um, let's see. Uh, Chad, uh, uh, Eric, um, that sometimes known as uh, Ric Flair, sometimes known as Raider Guy. Uh, does anybody know his channel uh, handle? Um, that'd be really <laughs> awesome. Have you guys uh, like, tried like, to protest other religions? Oh, we're moving on. I think there are plans, but it, it's going to be taking this one down all the way. And then perhaps any of the other ones that do family separation. Family separation happens so in, in the Jehovah's Witnesses, oh, right? Man. And so if you're out, then you're not allowed to talk to your family. It's family separation, right. basically. And so that will keep you in because the threat of leaving means that you're going to lose right, your whole you sure? life. You're going to lose everything that you know. Last chance. And everybody, every, everyone that's dear to you. And they also, they'll kick you out of the church if you, like, smoke a cigarette or date a black girl. So, yeah, and, like, 17-year-old, 16-year-old kids kicked down on the street by their parents because they're not adhering to the church. Like, the fundamentalist Latter-day Saints people, same deal. Sometimes just straight-up Mormonism. A bunch of teenagers on the streets of, you know, Salt Lake City. Their, their parents have just kicked them out. That's just, that, that happens all the time. So there's a bunch of them that do the same kind of thing and that destroy people's lives and especially children. And so I think, again, yeah. to survive the 21st century, these ridiculous notions need to go, need to go into the ash can of history. Because uh, yeah, if we're gonna believe in things without evidence, I mean, where, where are we gonna get to? You're not gonna get a rocket to the moon with that. Right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Very good. Did you get that handle from one of you? Doing? Oh yeah, right guys. Thank you. Thank you, for you do look kind of familiar. Did you guys come by here when, when this was open? No. Um, this is my first time in LA. Oh, okay. From New Zealand. Yeah. Oh, from New Zealand. Yeah, yeah. What's your name? Jared. Jared. Jared nice yeah. to meet you. I'm Mindy. Hi, Mindy. What's okay. your name? Uriah. It is. Hi, nice to meet it you. It is at BS Jared. Incinerator. Bumble. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Helvia Castle. Um, yeah. This, I'm so proud of this person. They were so brave to come out and and share with all of us. He's been out for the last three days in a row um, talking to different protesters. <coughs> He's probably going to do a bunch of interviews. Who's watching? Oh, up there. I mean, perhaps. 
Yeah. Does Jared have an Instagram my chat wants to know? What did he say? I don't. I don't do social media. Oh, he doesn't do social media, guys. Probably not. I, mean, I never see fingers. lights on in that building, to be honest. Right there. They're watching from yeah. right there. Yeah, for sure. From right there. Absolutely from are. From right there. Right, they've got cameras all over. Don't say I didn't ever place. do anything you know, for you. Why would he say that? Like, are Put you my neck out on the line for you. Oh, no, no, no. no. The, I mean, he, either he's having fun with us or he's like slightly paranoid. <laughs> That's okay. I think pro I thought protesting was legal in the Constitution. It sure is. No, no, no. He wasn't saying we can't protest. He's like, look out, watch your back. They're right. watching you from up there, and I don't think he had a clear idea of what he was really all on about. That's what I would say. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's pretty cool, though. I really appreciate both of you talking to us. I really, I really appreciate that. And I really appreciate everything you're doing. Thank you yeah, very it's much a, for saying so. What, do you know for sure what countries is Scientology already banned in? I know it's in New Zealand. In New Zealand it's banned? Yeah, France. France, Germany, right? They, they tried to open an org. I don't know if they're banned in France, but they tried to open a new org I in Paris. I did hear something about them in New Zealand. Right? Yeah, they're, no, they're, they're in Australia, I believe. Wow. But uh, yeah, you know, that's a very good question that I don't know the answer to. Thank you for stumping me. I, let, I, I need to go look that up. Hey, 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 let's see. Germany, they are banned, says Nance Group. Germany, give them more protesters information. I, I mean, I, I, I thought I named a lot. Of, I thought we named all the LA people. Did, did we, no, my, you didn't my, name me. I did name you. I don't think so. Oh, I didn't? Oh, I named you to the chat. This is Mindy Willis. <laughs> She's been out here for months. Yeah. Yeah, indeed. This is when is person. it still open? See, that's what I thought. They have four different orgs in Germany. So, yeah, China banned. Okay. So, <laughs> Paris is delayed. Paris is delayed. So Paris? Yeah, he's very knowledgeable. Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess. Um, yeah, so I'm going to need to look into this. It's, it, it, the wisdom of crowds is, is uh, rather, um, I think, uh, yeah, COS is in Australia. So I'm going to have to look this it's up It's conflicting? Yeah, a little bit conflicting. <laughs> conflicting. Yeah, yeah, there's a bit of confubility going on there, as I like to say. What so, is yeah. going on with all the cops activity? Another one? Uh-oh. Oh, hi, guys. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. Good evening. Hey, How you doing? Hey, somebody called you guys, right? So you guys worked out. Just grab them. Oh, I don't know. Just grab them. Just keep your hands up, guys, and go against the wall, and we'll talk to you guys right now. Wait, all of us? What? <laughs> we're like, what? We're, like, already on the ground. Oh, my Lord. What is going to do? What they in the totally world? Fine. What are you doing? They were just talking to us. What? This is obviously Scientology swatting them. This is Scientology swatting these kids. Oh, guys. I thought we were just going to come out and play this with is, chalk. This is absolutely disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Get them out of those cups as soon as possible. Are they tight? Can you get a finger through that cuff? I don't think you can. That's not regulation. Can you get a finger through that cuff? No, no space, no nothing. If there are marks on that guy, you're going to get a complaint. All of you. Name and badge number. Name and badge number. And I will wait for these gentlemen. Thank you very much. Thank you for waiting. Did anybody in there get any scanner information? Like from the scanner? Don't give them. You don't need to give them anything. Don't give them anything. You have done nothing wrong. You don't need to tell them anything about yourself. Don't identify yourself to these clowns. This is ridiculous. There's absolutely no reason. No reason. You have done absolutely nothing wrong. They have absolutely no right to ask
Because they're looking. The street, then this isn't there something better to protect than Scientology? Is there not? Is there actual policing to be done around here or not? Actual crime that is being conducted on the streets of Los Angeles or not? This is not a crime. Protesting is not a crime. This is absurd. What is your name and badge? I'm not going to relax. You have these guys in cuffs. I'm, I'm they are you. way too tight. I'm going to explain to you, right? Way too I'm tight. Get them out of cuffs. Okay. Am I going to risk them? Am I going to explain? I don't care. Your explanation is bullshit. Get them out of cuffs. Get them out of cuffs. Do not identify yourself to these officers who are acting as fascists. This is absurd. Anybody on this stream, download it if you can. I can't believe you gave him your information. I can't believe it. Get him out of cuffs. There are no danger. Get him out of cuffs right now. Get them out of cuffs. This is not interaction. These are fascists getting you to de show deference to their authority for nothing, for another swatting call. Ugh, can't Bullshit. Out. Bullshit. There we go. Nobody did nothing to no one. They were just coming you just up to show talk up to and us. Throw cuffs on people because of an assertion for a phone call. My ass. My aching freaking ass guys come on oh and you're gonna explain nothing to me nothing what are we doing why are they still in cuffs what are we doing guys what you're not investigating a damn thing they're standing there you've patted them down they're not armed I don't give a damn they've done nothing and you know it yeah, you've got some information, some secret, wonderful information. Oh, and there go the cuffs off, so it's total you are bullshit. Yes, you are correct. You know, it was correct the whole goddamn time about you guys overstepping the bounds, acting like fascists, putting the cuffs on too tight, and this, you just throwing your weight around for Scientology. Take it on the heel and toe, boys. What the hell? You know, you've traumatized these people. They were just peacefully talking to us. You just... What did he say? They don't look afraid. You don't understand psychology one little jot, my ignorant sir you. You don't understand that a situation like this, they will carry for years. You they literally ask. just said they the guys don't look afraid, so they didn't do any harm because oh, the guys don't look afraid. Identify yourself. Name and batch number. Name and batch number. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, I'm so glad I was here to support self with self during this moment. Oh my what god, if he was alone, was that, boys? he probably wouldn't be scared, but I'd be scared for him watching from home. You are brave. What the fuck? Yeah, nice one. Nice one, dude. Nice one. Nice lurker. What in the world was that? Uh, that was some serious fucking bullshit. They don't care. Don't get kids killed. Scientology does not care. They do not care. The cop literally said, guys, the cop literally said uh, that, oh, they don't look scared. They don't look scared. They don't look scared. I feel so bad for those kids. They I were, 
Yeah, they bugged out. Of course they bugged out. That was terrible. That was terrible. Oh, man. I really... I'm sorry that that was the end of our... Uh, of our uh, interaction with those kids because we were having a great time. We were given over a lot of information. Yeah. That was nice. They were having a great time. Yeah. And, uh, well, LAPD over here on Hollywood, it seems like a completely different beast with the with the tourists and everything. Hollywood division, right? Bunch of tools. Seems like uh, um, Southeast is maybe halfway yours. more reasonable. No, you can step all over it. It's, well, it's... you went down with it, so I didn't want to do that. Oh, you that's really nice. That's very kind. Thank you. You're welcome. Wicked. So, uh... They were watching our live, and this is intimidation. Somebody said in my way. chat. Yeah, so, you know, they went after the people that we were talking to rather than me and myself. See, I thought I thought I was being put up against the wall, so I... I, I thought put, it was going to be me and I you, put, but I was sure it was going to be me and you. Yeah. I was it, like, oh, here it is. It's time. <laughs> so here it is. Pretty much, I was ready, but... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh man. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Well, no, you're fine. Oh, oh, you're fine. Oh my god, I have a... No, you're fine. You're fine. No problem. Are you sure? So, yeah, no, I was pretty sure. So uh, that's a fair amount of adrenaline there. Okay, yeah. Oh, for I sure. hate LAPD now. Oh lord. I hate them. With a burning. Oh little my gosh, and this I've is just your first this is heart. your first one, huh? With LAPD. Oh yeah, but I've been yelling at the cops for a month yeah. just like that. Chicago PD will kill you just as dead as these guys, you know. And they, I mean, you know, a lot Are of you guys, guys take money from. Yes, we yeah. Are. Did you hear about this? Is a cult? On where? Yeah, this is a cult. Correct, it is. We just had the. Oh, look, a, a cult! I told y'all. Wait, where you like Wait can I, can I, can I paint something too? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Uh, let me write something. Did you write? Oh, okay, okay. Excuse me, excuse me. Oh, that was crazy. I'm, right. I'm gonna go home now, but sure. just because I'm, I only wanted to come out and say hi. All right. <laughs> See you later. Here. I want you to take this in case you need anything. Okay. Thank just, you. Okay. Absolutely. Bye. Wow, guys. <sighs> I'm gonna say good night to you guys. Love you all. That could have been it. <laughs> uh, thank you. I'm glad I went out to see him. I went, I'm glad I went out just to, like, I literally just, like, ran out in my PJs. I'm wearing PJs under this. <laughs> I'm glad I just ran out in my PJs and was just like, I'm going to give you a hug. Hey, nice to see you. You're right outside. <laughs> but... <laughs> And I was about to leave a couple times when those guys were talking with self with self. I was like, okay, it's time for me to go to bed. I have early work tomorrow, early. And I was like, wait, let's wait a little longer. And then they roll on up. I'm just like, love you guys. Ugh. Every day, leveling up, leveling up a little bit more. Are you playing Jackbox tonight? Should I? Should I get on Jackbox a little bit? You guys want to play? If I get back on in a minute, will you come play? I'm I might come right back. All right. I love you. I'm going to hang up with you and then go. I'm almost home, so.